A renewed effort to cut crime and to come conflict with the help of hairstylists. That's the goal of the city of Milwaukee's Style and Substance Initiative. Sarah McGrew shows us how this program will work. The city hopes to meet people where they're at when it comes to conversations about mental health and violence prevention. That includes right here in your stylist or barber's chair. LaToya Hurd primarily styles hair for young girls and she's heard it all. One girl told me she jumped out of the window one time to sneak out to a party. Um, a lot of times they tell me things like what they don't like about being their age or troubles at school sometimes. The trust between her and her clients puts her in a unique position to have an impact on their lives. That relationship of trust that they will believe what I'm telling them. So if I say I took a class, I got the experts, you know, resources, this is for you. They'll believe it. So she participated in the Office of Violence Prevention's Stylist and Substance Initiative to take what she already does to a whole new level. We can empower barbers and stylists as public safety ambassadors. The program was just relaunched. The focus is on identifying mental health issues, dealing with conflict, and providing people with resources. We will add some additional um, information around de-escalation tips, but also additional resources if people are experiencing conflict and they need assistance. LaToya says what she learned is already beneficial. It opened our minds to different types of mental illnesses and different signs of it. and. It gave me literally a physical list of resources that they can call. There's like therapists, there's housing resources and stuff like that. She hopes fellow stylists and barbers will do the same to help make the community happier and safer. Definitely step in, mainly because you don't have to be a person in a uniform or of a certain authority to help in your community. We are all a part of the community, which means it's all of our responsibilities to help. Reporting in Milwaukee, Sarah McGrew, TMJ4 News.